up. So we're going to do what's called a back extension. So really you're going to rest your weight on your pubic bone, definitely under your belly button. We're going to put, we can anchor our feet, usually on a wall. So I'm going to anchor my feet on my heating thing. We'll see how that goes. So you want to take that ball, scooch it under your belly button if you can, cross over. If you're new to this, if you've been doing it for a while, it's arms up. I'm squeezing my glute, my lower back's doing the work. And breathe. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful work. Put your hands on that ball. Let yourself down. We're on our knees. Fingertips are on the ball. I'm going to push it away. So roll it away. Drop those hips. And then pull it back in. I want you to be careful you're not collapsing into your shoulders. Weights on my elbows when I'm rolling out. Squeezing those glutes. Always squeezing those glutes. In the extension, the reason we want to squeeze our glutes is we want to protect that lower back. We don't want the weight of our body on our lower back. We want it in our legs where we've got a, lots of strength. Three, two, one. Gorgeous. So we're going to do a little bit of a roll down using the ball and it's actually going to be our shoulders are going to get a nice stretch out during this move. So we're in the front. We're going to bring our arms back and scooch it up. Okay, so I'm rolling back with my thumbs going over my head, reaching, scooping, rolling up. So you really want to be on your, on your mat for this so you've got some traction. I don't know if you've noticed, but I always do core work and bare feet. I find that it gives me a much better connection with the mat. I tend not to slip. And foot mobility is really key for overall body mobility. So I always like to keep my feet nice and limber. And that comes from working out barefoot.